Hello everyone, and welcome back to a Let's Play of Harry Potter and the Order of the Phoenix with the host Invalid. Where we last left off, we were once again exploring the castle, collecting kids for the uh, Dumbledore's army thing, and that's really about it. I <laughs> mean, what else is there to say? Um, got some tips from you guys about where to go for certain quest lines, specifically the uh, stuff for Flitwick and um, a couple other people. But there's still a lot left open to the imagination, and I'm really curious as to how we're going to help out Colin. So, was watching the footage back, maybe I have some, a couple ideas on what to do, but we'll see. Um, we're at the main menu because I wanted to point out something. Something that a few people have pointed out since that time. Um, I'm still using Mouse and Keeper. Many people have pointed out to me that you can actually use a an Xbox 360 controller for this game. Dual analog controller. You can if you want to. Um, I actually spent about five to ten minutes just wandering the grounds and experimenting with stuff and I found that I don't like it a whole lot more than the mouse and keyboard <laughs> and some of it some of it just has to do with already knowing the mouse and keyboard and being familiar with it and the limitations and all that other stuff versus having to kind of figure out the controls since I already passed the tutorial stage but I don't know the options there, you just have to choose in the in the config, in the uh, controller configuration menu. But I'm going to be sticking with this configuration because that's what I'm familiar with. Not that it's actually any easier or anything like that. So, <laughs> don't know. Uh, turn on. Turn auto save off before I forget and accidentally press the record button. Maybe I should switch over to controller. Fuck it. Okay, um, screw it. I am just doing controller. <laughs> you know, the, I thought about it a little bit um, after figuring out all that stuff. It's really not any better to be using the keyboard and mouse because the interact button is right next to the record button. I have the uh, the backslash as my <laughs> as my record button. So I get to go through this whole introduction again. Um, a couple things about why I don't like the controller as much: the spells don't seem as responsive with the mouse with the uh, gestures as it does with the mouse, which is kind of weird to say. Um, but it does feel a lot more fluid, which is kind of the point of using the controller. It really does, like, like people have pointed it out, it really does feel like the game is designed around controllers. And I mean, it's EA, so that's kind of what they do. Um, oh yeah, I can't actually move around with the, with the right stick in this one. So yeah, I'm using my 360 controller. Preparo. And this is exactly what I'm talking about. This this really sucks right here. Just I'm not doing anything wrong with this. I uh That really feels bad. There we go. Jesus Christ, it shouldn't be that hard. I could do that no problem in the mouse. I feel like it didn't have that much of a problem with it. The controller? I don't know. Sometimes it works, sometimes it doesn't. Even though the thing for the stick is perfectly circular. Maybe my controller is just a little worn and I don't know what the hell I'm talking about. But anyway. Um... 
Yeah, what were we doing? Let's just go ahead and check our... Whoops, wrong button. I'm going to have to get used to that. Let's go ahead and check our Marauder's map. Let's see, we have... Colin. Let's go right back to Colin. Because he's the one that we wanted to check out. Uh, that one. Scurrilous scoundrel. Scurrilous scoundrel. Sorry, just spitting on the mic there, my bad. I'm holding down the A button, let's go. Yeah, so I'll try an episode with the uh, controller and we'll see how it goes. Get an actual session in versus just ten minutes of testing. Five minutes of testing. Maybe I just need a different controller because this one's not working so well. Alright, uh, Colin is probably out. Yeah, okay, I know where we are now. Whoopsie. Alrighty. Where's Colin? I still haven't got my camera down. Will you help me, Harry? Sure. I'm sorry, Harry. It's got loads of good pictures of you in it, too. I seem to remember. I feel like Colin plays a bigger role, but I can't remember what it is. Uh, let's see, how did this one work? It's... Top... If they really want to education, I did it! Holy shit, I did it first try! Wow, I am impressed with myself. I fucking did it first try. God! Wow, okay, I... I'm the master of using... Wingardium Leviosa with the mouse with the uh, controller apparently. Holy shit! Alrighty then. I only took one look at the spell list. Deponso. That is not the button I'm. Okay, never mind. Never mind. I I am a big fibber. What are you even aiming at? Here. There we go. Okay. So it's one of the things I'm going to have to get used to is the difference in gestures, because with um. Everything on the controller. Let, let me just let me just show you. There was a there was a oh my god. Actually no, this is the menu I want. With the spell list, you guys remember with Axio it's just one up. With the pull or Axio is one one towards the player. The pulso is one away from the player. With the controller, it's twice. With the pulso, it's twice. And Reparo Reparo and um, I'm I'm assuming Reducto are basically the same, but when Guardian the when Guardian Livios is really interesting. Yeah, you have to go up on the on the analog stick before you actually do the left and right thing. And Incendio I think is pretty much the same too, isn't it? Yeah. And the weird thing about that is you don't have the whole click and hold thing to cast the spell like you do on the mouse. Which is, I find, kind of interesting. So it's just automatically, any time you move the mouse, it's taking that as an input for something. Uh, Expelliarmus and Protego are the same thing, where it's just the double, the double motion instead of the single. Which means that casting for the controller is actually way slower than on the mouse and keyboard. Which kind of sucks, honestly. <laughs> Okay, Rick Sempra's incendio, gotcha. Alright. Planting these things. We'll help, Harry. Oh, we never got rid of the devil snare? Incendio! What a hand? Incendio! No plant's going to stop, Harry. That Wingardium Leviosa. There we go. Okay, and right about there. So I may have boogered this a little bit. Let's see. Can Yeah, I can I can totally climb this. Let, let me up. Let me up. What am I what am I near that I can have climb? To climb up there, mate. Yep, this is exactly what I thought was gonna happen. I'm gonna have to climb up here. So what You'll I'm thinking. Uh, drop that. No, don't do that, you stupid thing. Thank you, that works. 
Alright, right about... I guess that works. They're all just staring at me and watching. Oh dear. So I think what I need to do is climb up on these and then... Yep! I have to climb up here! Great! Uh, and then... I guess I do kind of a... Push right on left stick to sidle? Like, why do I have platforming segments like this? Yeah, you're all the way down there doing jack shit. <laughs> you know what? I'll give it to him. They they came up with something innovative for this. Can I go faster by holding this? Oh, wow. No, I can't. Alright, let's go and grab this. Oh, well done. Yeah, thanks for the commendation. Do you think you could actually help me out here? Can I go up here by chance? I can totally climb up this pipe. Oh snap, is it gonna be something else up here? No. Th there's no point. It's just for continuity. Alright. Oh hell, how am I supposed to do that? The pipe's broken, what the shit? Oh, I... Okay, so it's a little... Uh, what was Reparo? That. Reparo! Oh, come on, I had it! You piece of shit, work with me. Work with me. I'm doing it right. I know I'm doing it right. You better fucking do this, okay? Like, I swear, you keep this up, I am switching right back to mouse and keyboard. Oh my god. Is this a speed thing? Holy shit, that was way too much work. Is there something else I can cast Reparo on? No? Okay, let's just sidle. Yeah, no, I'm going back to mouse and keyboard after this. That is ridiculous. <laughs> Trying to cast Reparo on that is ridiculously challenging. And for no reason. The only reason that's challenging is because of the... Uh, the input's not being read correctly. And I don't think that's entirely the fault of the game. I think some of that might be my controller. So maybe I need to switch controllers, actually. Yep, Nova's doing it again. You were literally right there! Fucking work, please. Alright, where's my other controller? <clears throat> Let's see if I can swap controllers on the fly real quick. Is this gonna work? Aha! It don't work though. Keep climbing, Harry. This is Shut so up. Cool. I wish I had my camera. All right. If I do this with that one, reconfigure. Brilliant! You're almost there, Harry. Is it... I think I broke it. <laughs> okay, it defaulted to mouse and keyboard again. Okay. <laughs> We're good. <laughs> Alright. <laughs> okay, good. Oh, that's so much better. Okay, I'm not doing... I'm not doing that again. Holy shit, that was bad. How am I going to get it down to him, though? That's the question. I'll stand down here to catch it. Oh, God, that's a really bad idea. You know that? Well done, Harry. Try using Wingardium Leviosa to pass it down to us. Uh. I've got it. Thanks. Harry, you're the best. Oh. I'm glad he was able to catch that. And now I have to get back down here. Great. Great. Just go. Yep, nope, can't move any faster than it would normally. Great. Fantastic.
Make it. There we go. Wow, Harry, thanks. You're great. I wish I could cast magic like that. Just wait till I tell Dennis. Harry Potter helped me get my camera back. Dennis will be so jealous. Harry, do you think you could tell him the story of how you got my camera back? Maybe Harry will tell Dennis if you bring him to the DA meeting. Yeah, of course. I'm not going to miss any of those meetings. Harry, you're going to be a great teacher, I know it. Come to the Room of Requirement on the seventh floor. Yeah, okay, I'll be there. Is it okay if I bring my camera? No, probably not. We don't want photos of a secret meeting. I won't bring it then. Great, no problem. Thanks again, Harry. I'll see you later. Bye. Colin's just so enthusiastic. Too many chocolate frogs. His brother's words. Yes, well, at least they both believe Harry. We need as many people on our side as we can get. Well then. I kind of wish we had the subtitles for that conversation, but oh well. This didn't get repaired? Are you serious? Reparo. Want a hand? Reparo. Yeah. There we go. Because I know I saved all that, all that stuff. Apparently that one torch wasn't lit. Okay. <laughs> randomly all the other torches are lit. Okay, I will happily take that. One torch to light them all. That was not... I fixed that. I guess you have to do all the repairs for one area to get it completed? Seems kind of weird, but... I mean, I'll take it, I guess. Do I... Can I climb up here? I totally can. Alright, what's up here? I have no idea because it, does it doesn't tell me anything. I can't look at I can't look at anything with a camera. Uh, so top of that, should be able to yeah, I can shimmy my way over. Okay, well this opens up a whole new avenue of exploration with this game then. Can I make it onto that? Apparently I can. Okay. Uh. What am I even climbing here? <laughs> There's nothing there. What? What? That horn tail almost got me. At least there are no dragons this year, unless you count Umbridge. That that line doesn't sit well with me. It's not Umbridge, it's... Umbridge isn't a dragon, she's a frickin' toad. Ugh. Do I burn it? No, not that. I, I can't do anything with this? That's weird. Alright, there it goes. Couldn't pass it for some reason. Well, for some reason I'm all the way up here now and I'm getting Easter eggs. Little callbacks. Can I get past? No? Alright. Well, I guess that's cool then. So that was it? All that for just an Easter egg? Alright. Get on the thingy. Shoot me down. Okay. Oh. Okay. Apparently you can do that. You can just slide down if you hold shift. That was a little terrifying. It was a little slower on the ladders in the boathouse, if I remember correctly. <laughs> Is there any reason to do this? Doesn't look like it. Oh no, there's another... ...thing... ...there. Good god. Alright, well Harry has balls of steel. Don't catch me doing that. Is there anything over here, or is I'm, or am I just climbing along this for nothing? I'm, I guess I'm climbing along this for nothing. All right. Can I get onto the piping from here? Nope. Why would they have that there if you can't do anything here? Seems a little strange. All right. Well, down we go, I guess. Wee! 
<laughs> and Ron and Hermione just staring at me like, are you nuts? No, I'm not. Harry is. Ooh, okay. 80% discovered, huh? Alright. Let's see that discovery view again. 80%, okay. Alright, that's done with. Holy shit. Alright, um... Not often in a Harry Potter game where I get the heebie-jeebies like that, but... That was... Oh, that was good. I talked to this one, didn't I? I don't really have time for chit-chat right now. Oh, okay, fine. Yeah, I think I talked to that one already. Uh... Hopefully I don't have to restart the gargoyle quest. That would be really annoying. So Colin's taken care of. Wait. Oh, he's he's back in the uh, the room. Gotcha. Right, Cho Chang's there. Angelina Johnson trophy room trap. What? Weird. Dean Thomas finding the gargoyles. I hope we don't have to restart these quests if we miss out on them, because, like, I know we have to do that with the portraits, but... Do, we... do I even have my wand out? Okay, there we go. There we go. Alright, I'm done. <laughs> Moving on. Okay, from here... Who was the Gryffindor Quidditch team they were talking about? I have to do this all again, don't I? Fuck. Eh, I'm gonna maybe not. I'm not seeing anything... ...about fixing these. So is that everything here? No, it's just 80% of it. Huh. Uh, excuse me. Jeez. So, th there's a few things I've learned um, about this game as well. A couple just more silly, random things. When you... E no, she's not. Let let's see if I can replicate it on the, uh, the mouse and keyboard. Protego! That's not what I meant to do. So, let's see if I can find somebody... Hi. Let's see now. I don't want to go on a Slytherin yet. I want to look for... Are you Slytherin? I can't tell. You are Slytherin. Okay, fuck you. <laughs> There's so many Slytherins out here. I'm not looking for a Slytherin. Are you Slytherin? Probably. So we got Ravenclaw, I think. Is that Ravenclaw or Hufflepuff? I can't tell. Get lost. Well, this is kind of annoying. I can't seem to focus on... Huh. That's really weird. That's really weird, actually. So, for some reason, if I use the mouse and if I use the mouse and keyboard, I can't focus on anyone that isn't Slytherin. I can only focus on Slytherin. With the with the uh, controller, though, I can focus on anybody. And it's kind of funny to do that with um, with a controller because when you do that, everybody will just start running away when you point your wand at them. 
It's actually really stupid and hilarious. Now, on the other hand, I still can do the combat walk. <laughs> what? It looks like he's dancing to something. <laughs> what the fuck is that head bobbing? Oh my god, I love this game. Alright, anyway. <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm having way too much fun with the stupidest things. The hell? I guess something fell off my bed. That was weird. Alright, anyway. Um, so from here, I think what we can do... Yeah, we're doing Teen, Dean Thomas's thing about the gargoyles. Can you smell mud blood? You're so funny. Look at the view. Marvelous, isn't it? You could see all the way to Hogsmeade if there weren't all those trees and we were facing the right way in. Where is Hogsmeade anyway? Hmm. Funny. I guess we need to have the quest active, because I'm not getting anything about any of that. It's kind of annoying. Ugh, for the viaduct, we probably have to light all these torches too. Ew. Yep. Ugh, whatever. May as well while I'm doing it. You know, one bit at a time sort of thing. Would you get a move on, Harry? Come on. Thank you. The other thing that's both annoying and really nice for mouse and keyboard is the fact that um, with the controller, the same, the same, what? Whoa, 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 hold on a sec. I just made the gargoyle breathe fire, what the heck? Okay, that's pretty cool actually. That's 70% of the viaduct. So... Oh wait, hold on. No, I can't lift you up? Damn. <laughs> yeah, I can make him breathe fire. <laughs> That's ridiculous, and I love it. The viaduct's all done now. I don't have to worry about that ever again. And that opened up something in the Room of Rewards, and we can take a look at that after the Let's Play is basically done. Hi to you too. Oh, the Weasley is our king bit. Ugh. That's, ooh, that's an oof. That's an oof and a half. Yeah, they don't really talk about much, aside from, um... Reparo! They don't really talk about much outside of the main, main storyline with, uh... Well, they don't talk about much of the storyline at all. It's just kind of hinted at through storytelling, or through uh, dialogue and stuff. Which I actually don't mind because they're at least mentioning it, you know. In the uh, first, in the third game and the fourth game, they really didn't talk about much. Like in the fourth game, they just kind of threw things at you. Like, oh, here's a major plot point, so I have a cutscene and a mission that kind of ties into it. With oh, hi, Myrtle. Why? I I don't really want to talk to you. So goodbye. <laughs> Actually, maybe she has something to say. Um, but in the fourth game, it was just kind of, here's major plot point for cutscene, and then here's a mission that might be sort of playable, and then random things thrown at you for the rest of the time. The third game didn't have much story about it at all, except for like the last two hours of it, which is kind of my main pet peeve with that game. Hogwarts 50 years ago. Yes. Yes. Well, do you want to make fun of me? No. 
I want to know if you ever used the secret passage behind Boris the Bewildered. Right. Do you promise to come back and visit me if I tell you the password? Yes, of course. It's forget me never. I hope you never forget me, honey. <laughs> of course I won't. How can I forget her? Twenty-two percent of the bathroom. Holy shit! Okay, nope. <laughs> nope. <laughs> That's too much. That bathroom is so small. How the fuck can I have discovered just twenty-two percent of it? That no. Uh. Ugh. Okay, um... What was I doing? Oh yeah, portrait. Stone bridge. I guess I can do stuff here as well. Incendio! So, anyway, what I was saying about the, uh... All right. The 360 controller in this thing is that... While it while it's annoying, it's also really nice because with the with this mouse and keyboard, um, the way that you switch between targets while you have your mouse out is separate from your mouse or whatever you're using for your gestures. So in my case, I'm using the the mouse to gesture, um, but I have to use the arrow keys to select a target. With the controller. That's all integrated into one thing. So your gestures are linked to the right analog stick, which is also the way you select targets. And this is not selected for some reason, so that's weird. Careful. That, okay, I guess there's no target there. That's weird. Um, so yeah. Now in the going back to the story bit with the with the third game, it didn't talk about the story much at all. With the fourth game, it kind of had cutscenes randomly placed in just massive exploration segments. And then you get to this game where it doesn't necessarily play out those parts of the story. But it goes, hey, here's some dialogue to mention this part of the story that's going on right now. So you kind of have an idea of where in the timeline you are. And I'm guessing this guy is somewhere on the staircase. Actually, I don't know. I don't think we've actually seen him on the staircase. He might be somewhere else. 89% here, huh? Alright, I'm guessing it's... I'm guessing the other 11% is that portrait. So tired. Uh, what I don't remember is if that guy's on the second floor or not. You go to floor two, right? Studious success. A healthy mind is an, an inquisitive, inquisitive mind. Who does the voice for that guy? It Another sounds so familiar. I wish the gray lady would help me with my homework. Oh, 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 I missed something. I see you. Uh, this. And we're done. <sighs> Don't, but... Pff, forgot she was a thing. The Grey Lady. Whose house ghost is she? What a good day for oh, I forget. Uh, there's the Bloody Baron, Frat Fire... Oh, she's probably, um... Uh, Ravenclaw's. Ravenclaw's ghost. Because Fat Friar is Hufflepuff, um, Nearly Headless Nick is Gryffindor, and the Baron is uh, Slytherin's. Whatever. So I'm guessing Grey Ladies is Wetsum's. Do you think that's because of that umbrage? Great, isn't it? Hi! 
I did not mean to I press enter next to you. That's really weird. Why can't I? Why am I switching targets? The fuck? That's bizarre. Okay, maybe I'm talking out my ass here, but you have dedicated keys to switching targets. You don't have that on the controller. Whatever. All right, we're going to find Dean anyway. Whoop. Right. Okay. Have you found those talking gargoyles yet? Not yet. We'll let you know. All right. So we do have the quest active. That's good to know. All right, let's go and find those gargoyles. I can just remember where the hell they are. Hello. What? That that's so weird. Why can? Ah. I don't know what's going on with those curtains, but it ain't working. Get lost, pip squeak. It ain't working like it should. God, why are we why are we cleaning the castle? It makes no sense. Where does this go? I can't go in there apparently. What? Alright, let's check the Marauders map. Where are we right now? We're on the second floor. You can make landmarks to each room, huh? Interesting. So, it's not the library. Where else could we go? Huh. I don't know where that is. It's just this random door that I can't actually go into. Alright, so I need to find... Oh, this is the viaduct entrance again. I don't want to go there. So this is the second floor. So second floor leads to the viaduct. Oops, sorry. Did I interact with this? I think I did. I put the list of DA members on the. No yes, yes. That's the Transfiguration Courtyard. Actually, is there anybody else that's here while we're looking? While we're looking. I don't think so. I know Dean Thomas is here. Oh, whoop, hold on. Oh, that's right, McGonagall's here. Okay. Then we need to talk to McGonagall real quick. Before I forget. And I think... Oh, there's another shortcut here. Thank you, sir. What? Oh, what's his name? I don't remember. Oops, sorry. Where is McGonagall? I really want to go to Hogsmeade. Are you... Uh... I guess this isn't where McGonagall is. So let's keep going then. You know, I could just do this. Oh, going backwards. No, going forwards. Apparently I'm going the right way. There's a talking gargoyle somewhere near here. Well, it ain't right where we are. Hello. Potter, Weasley, Miss Granger. What's this I hear about dragons in the kitchens? Please don't tell first years things like that. Someone's bound to be silly enough to believe you and go looking for them. However, ten points to Gryffindor for ingenuity. Mm. So, can I go into the classroom? <gasps> The transfiguring class is now unlocked. Cool. Sweet. That is pretty cool. And that is a mess. Guardian Leviosa. Incoming. Apparently she doesn't give a rat's ass. <laughs> okay. <laughs> Don't mind me, I'm just throwing your bookcases around. Oh, <laughs> uh, let's see what we can do actually here. Sure, 
Surely you have studies to attend to. Move along. Whoa. Oh, okay. She's surprisingly tall. I'm just trying to think back to the actress who plays her. I don't remember uh, Maggie Smith being that tall, but eh. Shut up. It's all right. We got a long gown. Who can tell? Okay, where is this again? This is the second floor. Okay, we were just here. Okay, so apparently there's a gargoyle around here somewhere. So let's go find it. And it was near where McGonagall was. Ah, here it is, right here. Are you a talking gargoyle? Do you normally talk to ones that guards speak? I don't normally talk to gargoyles. Or should imagine many gargoyles are grateful for that. Ouch. Thanks for talking to us. Let's go. She didn't seem very happy. Great. We only need to find one more. Dunno. Don't care, don't ask me. 258 years I've been here. 258 years. And has anyone thought to clean the spiders out of my nose? No, I have not. <laughs> okay. Ah. Things I've seen sitting here. It's amazing what you can see from the top of a plinth for over 258 years. I'll bet. I'm 258 years old, you know. And I think that qualifies me for a little bit of respect. Not wrong. Dunno, don't care, don't ask me. 258 years I've been here. Alright, we've heard that dialogue. So they have lots of dialogue, cool. So... I think we need to go back to the other gargoyle on the plinth, just cycle through its dialogue, see what else, uh, the one at the, um, I think, it's, is that the viaduct? I think it's the one the viaduct has to say. So that's four out of five, and the last one is on a stairwell somewhere, I think. Did we talk to that one already? No, 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 it's not that one, it's the, um... Whoop, wrong classroom. Are you still keeping your eyes open for gargoyles? Yes, Hermione, I'm keeping my eyes open for gargoyles. I'm trying to remember where the last one is. I seem to remember it being at the clock tower? Um, I know somebody... I know uh, Wario gave me the, um... You want to look gave me the locations of them, and I think he said it was on the fourth floor somewhere? The one that I'm thinking of, where it's out on a Don't balcony? Forget, we need to find talking gargoyles for Professor Ben's homework. Oh my goodness, Hermione, you are actually starting to get annoying. So, how can I get to the fourth floor? What a stinks. Like I'm listening. Well, of course, I farted. What do you expect? Oh, we'll this is the courtyard. Eyes and ears open. There Ron. are all over Hogwarts, but only some of them can talk. Wow, you're 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 as bad as it was in the third game. That was one of my other complaints about the third game, was just how much Hermione and Ron talked about reminding me this is where we need to go. Well, you know what? As much as I like the reminders, you could just put you that down on the Marauders map or something. Oh my fucking god! I don't remember her being this bad ten minutes the last time I played. Holy shit! Why is she so annoying? All of a sudden. Uh. Eh. This is what. Don't forget, we need to find talking gargoyles for Professor Ben's homework. Huh. Alright, well, apparently that's a thing. Okay, let's go. Fuck, this is the stone bridge. Okay, um... Whoa, 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 what? I can climb this? What? What is this nonsense? Okay, apparently I'm freaking Spider-Man or... What's that character from Infamous? It's like... Something McConnell? Oh, hi, Bats. How's it going? Oh, Bats. Is that it? 
I hope that's it. Yeah, I guess that's it. Okay, good. Now I can head back up and get out the hell out of here. Oh, my hand's phasing through the wall. What is this? Oh, this is this is black magic. This is not what I signed up for at Hogwarts Witchcraft and Wizardry. I'm just kidding. What was that noise, Harry? Is there anything over here? My infinite curiosity? Oh no, this is actually the way I have to go back. It's fine then. What are those noises he's making? It, 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 it mm, mm, mm. Not speculating, not speculating. Alright, let's just get down. So apparently that's not even breaking the, day, the game if you get up on this edge. You just, you just climb up. There we go, jeez, wheeze. Let me just face slam you real quick. You know, there's actually a question that I have for you guys who are right, really into the lore. Gryffindor and Slytherin always seem to be at odds. But... Hi. They seem like the only ones that are at odds with each other. Like Ravenclaw, Hufflepuff... Those two don't really care about rivalries. They're just doing their own thing. And Griffin, and they're cool with everybody. Except for the people that are actually dicks. We'll need to keep our eyes in so, there are, are there, are there is there a rivalry between summer. Ravenclaw and Slytherin? Or a rivalry between Ravenclaw and Hufflepuff? Or Hufflepuff and somebody? Like, or is everybody just... Or is it just Gryffindor and, Raven, and Slytherin that are like, Yeah, fuck your house. All right, what house are we on? This is three. Okay. Are you still keeping your eyes open for gargoyles? Oh my God! Shut up. Okay. Fourth floor. Go up. About to go up. Ah, here it is, here it is. Get out of the way, Ron! I found ya! Excuse me, can you talk? No! But you just did! No, I didn't! And who did? She did! That one there! The one with the bushy hair! My hair is not bushy! Ron, is, is my hair bushy? No. Well, only a bit. It's been windy, and I've been busy. That's all five gargles, isn't it? Let's get back and tell Dean where they all are. Why would it matter if your hair's bushy? Another word for bushy is volu voluminous? Voluminous? What's the word? What's that what's that descriptor? I had this I had this question like last week. <laughs> Two days ago. Run it, run it, run it, run it. You must be confusing me with someone else. I can't talk, not me. I haven't said a word my whole life. Are they all this mental? <laughs> You can't hear anyone talking. Uh huh. Interesting. Listen, can you hear that? See, there's no one talking here. There's no one here at all. Rabbit, 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 rabbit. <laughs> That's so weird. All right. So, all right. I guess that's it. Cool. We can go back to Dean and be like, "Hey, we found all the gargoyles, and they seem absolutely off the wall, diddly mad." Don't ask me what the hell I was saying there. Can we lift this? That one works fine. I don't know what the hell, what's going on. Some of them seem to work, some of them don't. I don't get it. Oh, save your noises, Hermione. Okay. Marauder's Map, Dean Thomas. Yep, let's go this way. What a good day for them. Indeed. Dragon's egg. Pass, friend to Hufflepuff. Going? Whoop. Yeah, I seem to remember. 
Because if he's a portrait for Hufflepuff, then where's the Hufflepuff common room? It's kind of weird. Hey, Dean. We found all those gargoyles. Oh, cool. Can I copy them down in the dormitory later? You'd better ask Hermione if that's all right. Of course. After the DA meeting. Cool. See you later. <laughs> I love how Hermione's just looking around everywhere else. Do we really have over half of them already? Damn, that was fast. Alright. Oh, sorry. You're so funny. Move it. Move it. Thank you. Uh, which floor was that one portrait on? I'm trying to remember. Was it floor three? Oh, Strind the Hufflepuff. Maybe he's not the Hufflepuff portrait. Maybe he's just the... Um, maybe it's just a portrait that likes Hufflepuff. I don't know. Anyway, let's go examine some floors and see if we can find that one portrait. The, uh... Ah, here we go. It was third floor. Hi. Is the password forget me never? My goodness, you know what? I think it is. Yes, yes, how could I have forgotten that? Let's see. All I need to do now is... Well... Uh, ah. <laughs> there we are. All right, Forget then. Forget me never. Thank you. I'd almost forgotten that. Hmm. And this takes us somewhere. This takes us up a floor. Okay. <laughs> and it's three percent of the uh, secrets in this in this thingy. Forget me never. What? Uh, ooh, oh, oh, well, yes. Yeah. <laughs> Hi. What are we looking at here? We have 84% of the secrets discovered, huh? Oh boy. I am... I'm not really looking forward to 100%ing this entire game just for the Room of Rewards, but... There's actually kind of a reason to 100% the game now. Because I do want to look at all those developer commentaries and be like, Okay, that's cool, and learn some stuff, you know? Yes, it could. What? I mean, you're not wrong, but what? Anyway, I think that is long enough for now. It has been 50 minutes by my recording. For you guys, it's probably going to be more like 45 or something after cutting some stuff. Um, but, with that being said, I think next time we're actually going to go see if we can find Ginny and complete the quest for Fred and George with Professor Umbridge. So until then, have a wonderful day everybody and take care. Bye for now. Um, quick little thing, just an addendum to the to the, uh, whatever episode. Um, so apparently it's not just the arrow keys that switch between targets. It's also um, right-clicking and left-clicking will switch between targets if you have mouse gestures turned on, so. Thought that was an interesting little tidbit. So anyway, see you guys in the next episode. Bye!